Hey everyone, I'm Megan Remblack and welcome to my channel, Meg Rem Softball. In this video, I'm going to show a hitting drill that you can do to work on those middle in inside pitches. It's going to help you work on keeping your hands inside the ball and it's also going to help you work on barrel control. So the props that I'm using, I have this noodle set up right on the outside corner. And I actually have a plunger that I put right at the bottom and it helps keep my noodle stand upright. I like to use the noodle because it's soft, however, I know not everyone has a noodle. You could use a T that's a little bit higher, you could use a net, you could use an L screen. Regardless, just have something right on that outside corner that's tall enough that forces these hitters to keep their hands inside the ball. So, how this drill works, we're going to be doing front toss. The tosser is going to be pitching more middle in, inside pitches. The hitter is going to take normal swings. However, they're going to make sure that they're keeping their hands inside the ball and controlling their barrel. So what do I mean by keeping their hands inside the ball? If this ball were to come in more middle inside, one, I have to catch it out front. I want to catch this ball out front. If I let this ball go too deep, I'm going to be jamming myself and I'm not going to get good power. So I'm catching this ball out front and I'm also keeping my hands inside the ball. So to keep them inside, I have to keep my hands in between me and this ball. If I let my hands come out, even just at the slightest, my barrel is going to get away from me. It's going to slow my hands down, my speed. I'm going to hit this noodle for the drill. I'll hit that noodle. But if I am going full speed in a game, obviously that noodle won't be there. But if I'm going full speed and my hands go outside of this ball and my barrel gets away from me, I'm going to be hitting that ball right on my handle. Right here. We've all been there. That stings. We don't want to hit that there. We want to hit it on the sweet spot. Everyone has a sweet spot on their back. That's where you get the most pop off your back. So in order to hit that sweet spot, I need to keep my hands inside me and the ball. So I'm hitting more inside of this ball. If I keep my hands inside, my barrel is not going to fly out. So I have this object there just for that reason. Those tossers are tossing more middle in. Inside hitter is avoiding that object, making sure they're catching this ball up front. They're staying connected. They're not flying all over with their barrel. And they're also making sure that their hands are staying through the zone. So I know, and I've done this drill a couple times with some girls, it's a little bit intimidating, especially if you have a harder object like a T or an L screen. Just make sure these girls are not ripping their hands out of the zone too soon. They're trying to avoid that object, so you got to make sure that once they get to contact, they're keeping their barrel through the zone as long as possible before they come around. So tossers, just make sure you're you're pitching more middle in, inside, hitters. You're staying connected, staying inside the ball, keeping the barrel through the zone as long as possible before coming around. And this is what it'll look like full speed. 